hope you guys are having a great day in this video i want to go over a very simple strategy with back tested results and a ton of previous plays that i've played on options on a simple trading strategy and this is going to be a trade lesson video in this video i'll be taking a look at many of my previous stock option plays and going over a very nice simple strategy that you guys can really really understand um especially lately we have been having a lot of these trading opportunities and we have been you know very very consistent with these uh, trading opportunities so in this video i want to go over that we had a banger play on boeing today and we entered in two uh option plays for the small account so if you guys do want to join the small account live buy and sell alerts we have three live challenge accounts that we're doing twenty thousand to uh hundred thousand in a year and that account is around thirty two thousand and then we have this account uh, which is a, a 1300 and then you know we have this account and then we have another account uh, which is 1000 to 20000 in under a year and that's uh count is around $2200 in a one single play so if you guys do want to join live buy and sell alerts i do have a 50% uh, off and just uh, type in 2024. You know, 2024 is going to be 50% off for lifetime. And, you know, we're absolutely killing it. So let's go over that uh, in the Discord. Because in the Discord, you guys can really see all of my previous trades, all of my losses, and all of my wins. So I want to have, you know, the most transparent uh, C right over here. So let's take a look at Boeing right here. Ticker symbol BA. Okay, we had this trade today. Uh, we were in this trade for a couple days, for almost a week now. Uh, we made a video on it. I made a video five days ago on, you know, my trade plan to make 100% on Boeing stock. And guess what? We made 100% today. It was up over 160%. But what I realized is that we have a very, very consistent, um, you know, strategy going on right here. If you just go to my YouTube channel and you go down here, you can see that the thumbnails are very similar. Uh, we had a play on. So this was Boeing, this was AMD stock, this is uh, Shopify stock, I believe, uh, this is this is Rivian, uh, this is S&P 500, you know, very similar setups uh, going on right over here. So what I want to talk about is this very, very simple trading strategy and make it into just one video and then potentially have a whole full playlist of trading lessons going back, seeing previous trades and learning um, from me. So let's get started. And the basic idea is really buying the low and selling the high and just playing the quick bounces. With Boeing, we saw that 200 was a critical level of support. And we know that this is a critical level of support because previously we have held this level a lot. So one, uh, you know, consideration is we need to hold, we need to find a level of support that is solid, that is critical. So mentally, this was a critical level of support, $200. And we have tested the support many, many times. So this was a viable level of support. Um, we could see that price action is king. Okay, Price action is everything for the markets. And with Boeing, we saw that. And throughout this video, you will see on how price action is literally everything. You don't need any indicators. You don't need... You know, options flow or algos or AI, everything is price action in my opinion. And that is my biggest trading strategy. So 200 was a critical level of support and we sniped the bottom. The idea is to play the bounce. Now you can play the breakout, but the probability is a lot, a lot lower. From my personal experience, I've got burnt a lot from playing the breakout, uh, playing the breakout. So for example, um, you know, these burnt losses, a lot of them were from playing the breakout. So playing the bounces is going to be the key. And the second thing is we need to hold this level of support. Okay, we need to hold this level of support because now 
you know, I have many, many successful trades that I could go over, but I want to go over a lot of the losses. So XPEV was a very, uh, you know, simple loss. We played the breakout right here. We did sell out, but I entered in a can and I played uh, the bounce again, but it closed below. So the key thing is that the stop loss is the close below. And when we break that level, we are breaking the whole trend to the downside. So XPEV is an example of a loss. Ticker symbol NIO is another example. We traded sideways, we consolidated, you know, we just kept, we just held this level. It even broke out for a second, it tested as a level of support, but once it broke to the downside, it just plummeted. Now, the interesting thing about NEO is that it is actually consolidating again. So we do have another setup right here. So this would be a great example to buy and calls at and then leave the stop loss close below. But the risk is the earnings. So I would not play this, you know. Be careful with earnings. We got burned with Rivian earnings. So Rivian is another example. You know, again, critical level of support. We know that this is a critical level of support because we have tested this level many, many times. Uh, but with earnings, it dropped. So price action is everything for these plays. Roblox was a very, very successful trade where we traded the bottom off the support. So again, this was a very, very you know, similar low. This is what is called a accumulation phase. I'll probably make a whole video on this. But the very simple idea is that we are sniping the bottom. We are buying low and then we are selling high. We got out uh, right here for Roblox. So that is the very similar strategy. Now, these are shares plays. You know, Rivian, a lot of these plays were shares. What I want to talk about now is, again, option plays. So the next thing that I want to take a look at is blue chip stocks. Okay, blue chip stocks. Boeing is a blue chip stock, Apple billion dollar market caps that are in the S&P 500, the QQQs, you know, companies that we are aware and familiar with. So now I want to talk about, you know, Apple, AMD, um, other stocks, Shopify. Apple is an amazing, amazing example. Okay, again, buying low, selling high. We know that 100 is a critical level of support. Now, how many of you guys in the Discord have played this play? We have played Apple two times. Okay, we played the bounce here and we played the bounce here, and now we are playing the bounce again for Apple. So, really simple again, really simple 180. Mentally, pretty good number, decent. It's it's an even number, but we could see that it is a solid level of support. It was a previous level of resistance. So this is a viable level of support. This is on the daily time frame, and then we have a extra bonus, which is the ascending triangle on the weekly time frame. You know, previous uh, ascending triangle right here. But very simple. We have the level of support, one hundred and eighty dollars, and again price action is everything okay this is everything price action is king these candlesticks matter okay look at how we never close below look at how we are respecting this level this tells us everything so what we do we snipe calls right here at the bottom i sniped calls right here alerted on discord this is going to be a very nice play this is going to be a future play but we got in calls right here our stop loss is going to be the close below 180 dollars on the daily time frame so this is the area you know the price target you're going to set as the next level of resistance we got 185 we got 190 we got 190 uh you know 190 uh, 200 dollars so you know let's go back to boeing because I want to mention this, that price action is every single thing. We had a lot of patience for Boeing because we got in like right here. We got in, we got in right here on this wick. We got like the low, low, the absolute low. And for two days, we were just trading sideways. But look at this price action and it eventually paid off. It just broke out. The resistance was the price target and it was up over 150, 160% on the call options and we got a weekly call options. Now a great thing about strategy like this is you can play the closest expiration and you could play weekly call options because you are sniping the bottom. So you could just get in a quick scalp and buy calls at the bottom. So Apple is going to be the next play for that. Another example.
And if I have any other plays like this, I'll keep you guys updated on Discord and YouTube. But this video was for the trade lesson. AMD is another example. Now, we played AMD calls right here. Go to the Discord. Go to Swing Trades. Scroll up. You guys can see that we played AMD calls right at the level of support. And we played the bounce. You can also try playing the puts. I haven't really personally tried that again. This is my personal trading strategy. I've crafted, you know, this skill and I'm kind of showing it to you guys. But for AMD, I want to wait uh, right here. If the market drops, I want to buy and calls right here, buy low and then sell high price target that. Now, we can also play the breakout. You know, we can play the breakout, but the confirmation is going to be the close above at the breakout. So Shopify is a great example with that. With Shopify also, we played this. Go to the Discord. You guys can see we had an amazing, amazing play. I think if I go to the Discord right now, we had some insane gains on Shopify. So again, these were our Apple plays. We had insane gains on Shop uh, on Shopify because we played the bounce for Shopify right here. You guys can uh, go to the Discord, swing trades, and scroll up. So Shopify was another example. We played the bounce, but with Shopify, it did break out. So you guys can see that we got you know two bulging green candles. It broke out with earnings. It dropped, and now it doesn't look good. It's it's trading below. Uh, it's chopping, and it's very unclear. The price action is not good. So these are some really really great examples of what we are taking a look at but at the end of the day it is all a probability game okay that is the main thing in this video you know, it, it it is all a probability game so spy is a huge huge example of this okay if you guys have been watching me for you know for, for, for three years this is like the most common strategy for spy we just trade sideways we trade between the zones we can buy calls at a 501 you know we've played spy on the discord we had a nice small account challenge play um on spy but spy trades just like this buying low selling high playing the breakout you know and all of that so overall hope you guys enjoyed this video i just thought i would make this video and then i'll have a playlist of trading lessons so that i go over all of my you know really previous trades and make a lesson on it so i can you know go back people can educate themselves and and see all of that so hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys did enjoy videos like this make sure to leave a like i have a lot more educational content coming out for 2024 Education is going to be a huge thing. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and see you guys later.